Hello everyone, welcome into your CBS in Denver Daily Sports Line for Wednesday, June 2nd. Coming off a really good start to the month yesterday, had my guy Ben Carey from CapWise join us. He gave you the Nuggets minus two and MPJ over two and a half three-pointers. Both of those cashed. I told you my best bet yesterday was the Nuggets first quarter spread minus half a point. That one cast easily. So a clean sweep, 3-0 and yesterday on the program. Hopefully we can uh, follow that up today with another winner for you. Big game tonight, game two between the Avs and the Vegas Golden Knights. No surprise here, the Avs favorites in this one. Plus 135 is what you're going to get if you take the Avs on the puck line. The over-under is at 5.5, and, and Colorado to win the game is minus 200. I do think that's a little too much money to lay on the money line there. I think this is going to be a fantastic hockey game. I think it will not resemble game one, seven to one victory in the Az in the slightest part because of Marc-Andre Fleury. Marc-Andre Fleury going to be back in net tonight for the Vegas Golden Knights. They are coming off a full two days rest in between games. First time they've had that in more than two weeks. They went every other day in their round one series against the Wild, which went to seven games. I think this is going to be a close game. I think it is going to be uh, a, a real real goalie dominated affair. Andre Fleury played really well against the Avs this season in seven games against Colorado. Six of those seven games went under the five and a half goal point total. He allowed just 2.14 goals per game against the Avs. He's had four days off because he didn't play in game one. The uh, Vegas team, as I mentioned, has an extra day off now here too compared to what they were getting in round one. And the Avs only got shut out twice this season. Marc-Andre Fleury was in net for both of those games. So that is why my best bet for tonight is going to be under five and a half. Now, of course, this also has to do with Philip Grubauer, right? Both Grubauer and Flower are Vesna Trophy finalists, and for good reason. Grubauer's allowed just 1.6 goals per game in the playoffs. These were two of the best goalies all season long. The price has actually changed on the under a little bit. It was at minus 105. Now it's at minus 115, so you're getting a little less money back. But I still like this game to go under 5.5. I could see this being a 3-2 abs win. The only thing that scares me here is I don't like betting an under in a game in which Colorado is playing because we know about the abs and their offensive firepower. But I'm going to trust the goalies tonight. Two of the best in the league all season long. I trust that they're going to keep this thing under five and a half goals. I could see this as 2-2 going into overtime. I could see the Avs winning 3-2. The only thing that I, that I really worry about is an offensive performance from the Avs. And maybe it's 3-2. Maybe they get an empty net and maybe it goes over five and a half. But I'm pretty confident it's going under five and a half today. That is my best bet for your CBS in Denver daily sports line. Brought to you as always by BetMGM. Place your parlays, props, and futures at the King of Sportsbooks. Download the app today.